remember most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was in God, and in one who fled to the perfection, implored I all for a supper and possession, was abandoned. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto thee, O perfect Virgin, my mother, to be the divine God before the eyes of man, sinful and sorrowful, a mother of the word of God, despise not thy petitions, but in thy clemency, fear and answer me.
the light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. O Lord, you have been our refuge from one generation to the next. Before the mountains were born, or the earth or the world brought forth, you are God without beginning or end. You turn men back into dust and say, Go back, sons of men. To your eyes a thousand years are like yesterday come and gone, no more than a watch in the night. You sweep men away like a dream, like the grass which springs up in the morning. In the morning it springs up and flowers, by evening it withers and fades. So we are destroyed in your anger, struck with terror in your fury. Our guilt lies open before you, our secrets in the light of your face. All our days pass away in your anger, Life is over like a sigh. I span seven years, or eighty for those who are strong. And most of these are emptiness and pain. They pass swiftly, and we are gone. Who understands the power of your anger and fears the strength of your fury? Make us know the shortness of our life, that we may gain wisdom of heart. The Lord grant his anger forever, show pity to your servants. In the morning, fill us with your love, we shall exult and rejoice all our days. Give us joy to balance our affliction. <coughs> For the years when we do misfortune, show forth your work to your servants. Let your glory shine on their children. Let the favor of the Lord be upon us. Give success to the work of our hands. Give success to the work of our hands. Lord, you the Father, into the Son, and into the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. The word of the cross is folly to those who are perishing. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to make music to your name, O Most High. To, to proclaim your love in the morning, and your truth in the watches of the night. On the ten string lyre and the lute, with the murmuring sound of your deeds, O Lord, have made me glad. For the work of your hands I shall rejoice. O Lord, how great are your works, how deep are your desires. The foolish man cannot know this, and the fool cannot understand. Though the wicked spring up like grass, and all who do evil thrive, they are doomed to be eternally destroyed. But you, O Lord, are eternally on high. See how your enemies perish. All doers of the evil are scattered. To me you give the wild ox a strength. You anoint me with the purest oil. My eyes look in triumph on my foes. My ears 
of Deuteronomy. The Lord your God has chosen you from all the nations on the face of the earth to be a people peculiarly his own. It was because the Lord loved you and because of his fidelity to the oath he had sworn to your fathers that he brought you out with a strong hand from the place of slavery and ransomed you from the hand of Pharaoh, king of Egypt. Understand then that the Lord your God is God indeed, the faithful God who keeps his merciful covenant to a thousandth generation toward those who love him and keep his commandments. Thy will be done on earth as 
it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Keep your family, O Lord, schooled always in good works, and so comfort them with your protection here, as to lead them graciously to gifts on high. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your Spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. May the divine assistance be always with us. And also with our brothers and sisters. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she should conceive by the Holy Spirit. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. May it be done to me according to thy word. And the word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death, amen. Pray for us, most holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Pour forth, we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ thy Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. amen.